I wanted to talk about how the enemy's kingdom, whatever you want to call them, the devil, the dark kingdom, dark whatever you want to call them, is obsessed with copying God and divine ones. And I remember um, being on plant medicine and raising my vibrations to the point where I could hear um, that my ancestors wanted to dance with me and I could see them and they were so happy to see me and they wanted me to dance and what I realized is even in them Greek sororities and fraternities it's mimicking you know I, I was listening to this one YouTuber and he was talking about how his family has a dance and you know down to the crest down to everything the royal family has a crest and your lineage has a dance your, your tribe has a dance and so dance with your ancestors when they invite you when you when you when you raise your vibration and you feel that invitation dance with them they love it and and the closest you get to hearing you know your ancestors and higher beings is when you are at a raised frequency you know when you're laughing when you're dancing when you're bubbly when you that's that's when they can you know grab a hold of me usually is it's it comes from dance and laughter but what i would say is um dance with them and when i was thinking about the strolling you know with the sororities and fraternities and how we're drawn to that um and god was dealing with me about how you know i was like well I was drawn to this because this and he was like you know because they mock who you are they mock you know who we are and absolutely you remember um some of those things you know having family dance having tribal dances having a family crest you know um all of those things were taken from the divine kingdom um obsessed with mocking god it is so it is like weird like i don't get it like like, I would listen to these, like, chosen one copy, you know, copycat videos and totally re resonate and relate. But, dang, like, just obsessed, you know. So, yeah, if you're a divine one, if you're chosen and your ancestors invite you to dance with them, dance. Dance with them. You know, that's who you're supposed to be dancing with. You're not supposed to be dancing with these evil people who... All y'all got low self-esteem and don't know who you are because you went and got your ass beat to be a part of something that ain't got nothing to do with you. And it's demonic. It's just a long story about all that. Dance with your ancestors. Everybody's so scared of ancestors, you know. Um, everybody's so like, oh, you know, if you, I'm not religious, you know. And for me as a chosen one, you know, my relationships are different. Absolutely. The most high contacts me. Absolutely. My angels contact me. But absolutely my ancestors contact me. Whether it's through dance, whether it's through songs, whether it's through... I can hear them calling, you know, a nigga that they don't want me to be with a peasant. Like, they don't play about me. And so, you know, I don't know about other people. A lot of the things that they say that, you know, you guys should not be tampering with are really only for the chosen one, you know. So, a lot of the the, the, the stones that y'all be playing around with, a lot of the spell, all of that is really, a lot of the spiritual stuff that y'all have been scared to touch, it's for a reason, but it's specifically for certain beings and so you know i have a divine right to absolutely certain um magic certain washes certain herbs knowledge about certain herbs crystals will work for me differently than they would work for an, a non-divine being i'm sorry they just do you know what i'm saying the same thing with when it comes to plant medicine shrooms work differently for me than they would for a regular human being um, and that's just what it is. You know, I used to, you know, recommend them to people thinking, you know, it would have some type of profound impact and they would have some type of meeting with their ancestors and angels and the most high God. And they would sit down and evaluate their mission and what they needed to do and what needed to be cut off to be moved forward. And, you know, I thought it was going to be some type of profound experience, but I understand that the plants react differently to me. The crystals react differently to me. So everything, nature, the birds, squirrels everything reacts different to the chosen one so i'm not saying for everybody but for me personally absolutely my ancestors especially the elevated royal beings that they are um absolutely reach out to me in different ways and i so appreciate it and so if you you know especially if you know that your chosen one and it's been confirmed to you 
embrace your ancestors dance with your ancestors you know they they love it and they they can relay messages when you when you lift your vibration and and you're in that flow state you know in that flow state you can receive messages and so um yeah just mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yes <laughs>